Hey guys, Sam here from keycommerce.com. In this video, you're going to learn how to set up your Bing ads by importing from Google Ads. It's an awesome trick. You need to have your Google Ads already set up, but by following this process that I'm going to show you in this video, you're going to be able to set up your Bing Ads in just five minutes. If you don't have Google Ads already set up, I'll leave some links in the description to how to set up your search campaigns, branding campaigns, shopping campaigns, and once you set them up in Google, you can then export them, import them, over to Bing Ads. Let's get into my computer and I'm gonna show you exactly how to set these up. Let's go. Okay guys, we're now in the Bing Ads account. Let's now import our campaigns from Google Ads. Click Import Campaigns, Import from Google Ads. It's gonna open up the wizard here with the step-by-step, -step, super easy. We're gonna click Sign Into Google. It's gonna pop up, we're gonna to have to sign in, so make sure you follow this process yourself. Okay, now it's signing in. Awesome, it's now given us a list of all the stores we have connected. You might only just have one store, um, so just select your store, click continue. Now it's gonna ask us, do we want to import all existing and new campaigns or just specific campaigns? We're gonna select the second one because we just wanna choose which campaigns we wanna see. It's now gonna show us all the campaigns. Now I'm just gonna select the ones that are winning campaigns, ones that have performed really, really well. They're doing well, and so I just wanna keep them over on Bing Ads. You might not want all those campaigns, just choose the ones that, that actually do are doing really well. Then select continue. Now this bit here is gonna ask us about the settings and this is largely if you're importing multiple times. So if you import on a schedule, which some you may wanna do, it's a bit more advanced, um, then you can select um, to update the bids, the bidding strategies. When you change them in Google Ads, it's then gonna change them uh, in Bing Ads as well. But we just wanna uh, import them once and then run them separately. So just click continue. Okay guys, it's now asking us uh, the schedule imports. Now we don't wanna schedule the imports for this one here. I recommend your first time importing them in once and then managing them on their own separately from Google Ads. This mean, this is because potentially the people that go to Bing Ads and your campaigns that perform on, on Bing Ads are gonna perform differently than on Google Ads. So I wanna optimize differently. I don't wanna update and make it exactly the same as Google Ads because the traffic is different. And so I'm gonna to go to when and change it to now. And then it's only gonna import once right now. Click import, it's then gonna do its magic. Great guys, so now it says, congratulations, we have successfully imported your campaign. So you can review and maybe there's some issues here. It'll tell you what they are. And if you need to go review them, that might just be because the policies on Bing Ads are slightly different than on Google Ads. That can happen. So you just have to review them, troubleshoot, and then fix them yourself. Then you click view imported campaigns. Okay guys, so now we have the campaigns here. We can see them here in our account. That's how you import your campaigns from Google Ads. It takes less than five minutes. You need to have those campaigns set up on Google Ads already. Check out my other videos. I walk through how to set up brand campaigns, shopping campaigns, search campaigns. Um, but once you have them set up and they're working well, you can then import them over to Bing Ads, just like I've shown you in this video. And then you can start running on Bing Ads as well for your e-commerce store. Okay guys, that's how you set up your Bing ads from Google in less than five minutes. Super quick, super easy. But like I said, you need to have these campaigns already set up in Google beforehand. If you don't have them set up, then check the description. I'll leave some links to some tutorials that I've made on how to set up these campaigns yourself. Now, if this video was helpful, guys, I really appreciate it if you leave a thumbs up. And if you just tell me in the comments, hey, this was helpful, or if there's any other videos you'd like me to help you with as well. Check out my channel. I make a lot of videos like this one. I put a lot of time into these tutorials to make sure they're the best that you could possibly get. Um, so I recommend subscribing if you want to follow along and turn on notifications. Apart from that, guys, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.